All right, Hefty here with 492W. I want to do a quick overview of all the uh, projects that are going to happen for the course. Let's take a look. All right, the first two projects are your foundation pro uh, projects for the course. They're going to make up almost 50% of your total grade. So project one are your weekly quizzes that are due on Monday mornings at 8 o'clock. This is going to be over uh, content uh, that we'll cover but mostly over textbooks, readings, uh, terminology in the business industry, and then response quizzes to responses to some um, situational questions and research that we'll bring out. Again, you can see it's 25% of your total grade. And it's a way to reward students that are looking at all the content, not being selective as we go through the course and uh, taking notes when we're meeting live. Project two then is the other foundation piece, and this is your CPD discussions. CPD stands for Continuing Professional Development. This is where we're gonna take the subject from the textbook that week that we do the quizzes on Monday over and lectures, and have you look for complimentary or new information on that subject area. And you're gonna share that research on a discussion board, and then also look at ways to take uh, your peers information and apply it to your business design. You can see that's 24% of your total grade, and there's 12 of those total throughout um, the term. All right, project three then is your first written uh, project assignment. Uh, it's business leadership vision where you're going to start to describe the type of business you're designing for the course. We're gonna use then the terminology from the textbook and from the lectures and some of the research from those discussion uh, search and shares with that. You can see here now that's 10% uh, of your total grade. These uh, written projects are typically due then on Fridays at 8 a.m. or flex days. You'll upload those to Canvas. It's required to do that so that I can check that with Turnitin, which is a plagiarism component. Uh, so the point here is do not cheat, just reference correctly, and we're not cheating and not plagiarizing. Project four then is your second written uh, project. Again, uploaded to Canvas. It's a human resources development. This is the uh, department of the business that deals with the hiring, the administration, and the training. Again, you can see we start to increase um, um, the percentage of your total grade, so it goes up to 12% there. Again, must be uploaded to Canvas. Project five, that's your third written uh, project. It's a business research and analysis report. This is simply where you're gonna do some benchmarking of similar businesses in the industry to the one you're designing and uh, do um, talk about your research. But from that, you'll use some analysis of how you can apply what you've learned from real life businesses in the industry. Again, now we're moving up to 13% of your total grade. Again, must be uploaded to Canvas to get an official grade. All right, last is project six. This is your final business plan. Um, it's 120 points, as always, upload to Canvas, due at 8 a.m. Um, it's 19% of your total grade. So it's due the last day of class, but since it's more than 10%, you can request an extension um, um, until Tuesday of finals are come required by Penn State to do that. Key point here, I have to have something by Thursday so that I can enter grades. Um, but again, after Tuesday, then it starts to be 10% um, deducted for each day it's late. Real simple, each of these parts are from uh, previous projects, so you should be able to copy and paste. The key here is that you look and make edits and improvements, not only using the projects, but using your quizzes feedback and essays, along with your research discussions and peer reviews. Again, make sure everything matches. You want to be successful at the end because this is really what everything is built up to. Thanks.